And the opening tip. It's the Ducks in control. Bowley in the backcourt. Here's Maite into front court. Take it around to the right side up on the wing. Looking at it is out front. Savali puts it on the way. Good by Satu Savali. She drills the three from just off the right side of the arc. And Oregon jumps to a quick 3-2 lead. Here is Drummond around to the right side. Here's Monica Hia on the drive. She'll give it back out front. Adam Monica splitting right down the middle. Hands it off. The shot is no good. And the rebound, it's... Sabrina Ionescu, who takes it off the board in Oregon, coming back left to right here at Met Knight Arena. On the left side of Cazorla. Cazorla picked up out front there by Cooper. Gabrielle stays right with her. Out on front, top of the circle to the left side. The shot on the way, missed by Sabali. She had a look at it, Satu a little strong with the shot. And here comes Syracuse back down the floor. Swing it right side, Gabrielle Cooper down toward the baseline on the right side. Nice little turnaround jumper is good. That was Stratmana. And Digna picks up her first couple of points of the ball game. Here come the Ducks now. Left side of the floor to Ionescu. Up top to Cazorla. And swing it over right side to Bowley. Look at the ball around. Bowley has it open. Look, good for three from outside. Bowley. Gives Oregon the 6-2 lead here as we get it underway in Eugene. Monica Nia, nice slide pass. Works it all the way underneath to Finkley and Amaya able to get that ball, push it right up off the glass and in from outside. Bowley for three, good from the corner down on the right side. It's a shootout here early. The Ducks and the Orange and Oregon is on top. 9-2, Oregon with three, three-pointers to the left side. Syracuse got the ball up on the rack. It's no good from the corner on the left side. Quickly down the floor, come the Ducks. They're running, slide it out. Cazorla, pop it up to Bowley out beyond the arc, about two steps on the right side. Yonescu, they move it around. Cazorla inside, Bowley goes into the lane, pulls up, fires one off the left side of the rim. It's no good. We have a whistle and a foul going to be called. It'll be against the Ducks. It's a pushing foul on Sabali as Satu picks up her first in the game. Ducks with the lead here. Oregon 9, Syracuse 8. Cues into front court. Monica Dia. Round to the left side, Cooper, Gabrielle underneath. It's poked away by Ruthie Hebert. Ducks coming away with a steal, go to Ionescu. Coming up in the right front court to Bowley. Drops it off, top of the key. Now on the left wing to Cazorla. Defensively, Syracuse playing that man-to-man -man pressure from outside. The shot on the way. Bowley a little short with the shot. Rolled it over the rim, and Syracuse coming away with the basketball. Monica Hia at front, and then a whistle and a three-second call. Caught camping down inside. Syracuse. And the Ducks with the basketball. It's a 9-4 ball game, by the way. Scoreboard just got a little bit out of kilter up there. 9-4 Oregon. Stratman and Finkley with a couple of buckets for Syracuse, but the Ducks shooting well from three-point land. All three of their shots that have gone in have been for three, two by Aaron Bowley. Here comes Cazorla, nice drive down the lane, put it up with a right hand and scores. Cazorla taking the right side of the lane, it was open as she put that arm up and dripped it right off the glass and in. There's a little move inside, the turnaround shot blocked away by Ruthie Hebert. Ruthie working inside on Jaldi Tabdi. Knock that ball from here to Tuesday. And the Q's will inbound from the right side of the goal here. 6-19 left to go in quarter number one at Matt Knight Arena. Ducks lead it. 11-4 and inside a whistle and a foul. And it's going to be an offensive foul. It's going to go on. I believe it is on top Todry. It was on Tabdi. And the ball comes back to the Ducks. They'll push it up into front court. Oregon working with that 
11 to 4 lead. Here's Bowley. She's open from the right side. Kicks off the back of the rim. Loose ball. Tipped away out of bounds. And it's going to go the way of the Q's. The Orange. As that ball went off one of the Ducks down there. Trying to grab it before it went out of bounds. Good effort defensively down there by Syracuse. That was Miranda Drummond at 6-1. Playing it tough on defense. Monica Hia brings it up into front court here for Syracuse. The point guard, she runs the show. Top of the key and a whistle down inside. Another offensive foul. This one's going to be against Syracuse. And I believe it's going to be once again on Jolty Tobdi, and it is. And Oregon will get pressure now. Full court press put on here by the Orange. Here comes Cazorla. She's right in front of us at midcourt. Drop it back to Bully, walking over the midcourt line. Aaron to Corzola to the right side, and then we have a uh, travel called. It was down in the corner. The Ducks got it to Sabali and Satu just shuffled the feet a little bit as she came up the baseline. First turnover by the Oregon Ducks here in the first quarter. Still 527 left to play in the first quarter. Change in the lineup now for Oregon as Ruthie Hebert will come out. Oregon gets Adi Gilden in the lineup to replace her. Here come the Orange now, attacking the basket at the other side. Shot up off the rim, underneath the rim. They got the shot up, but couldn't get it to go, and the Ducks quickly come back up into front court. Oregon, nice pass, underneath. Wide open is Gilden and Adi there for the shovel up off the glass and in. And the Oregon lead is now at 13 to four. Biggest lead of the game here for Oregon at nine and Syracuse in left front court. Monica here shifts, takes it down the lane with the right side finger roll up off the right side and good And Tiana gets her first basket of the ball game and the Ducks lead it 13 to six. Here's Oregon now in right front court, right side. Looking underneath is Sabali. Cazorla down to the baseline, and Bowley's jump shot off the glass at the rim and goes out. And let's see who they're going to call this one on. It's going to be a foul. It looks like it'll go against the Ducks. Satu Sabali, and the crowd is not liking the call. And we have our first timeout on the floor here with 4.22 left to play in the first quarter. The Ducks on top. 13 to 6, coming back to Matt Knight Arena here on the Oregon IMG Sports Network. Thank you, Nick. With a couple and two for Gilden as we come out of the timeout. And here's Syracuse coming up into the front court. The Orange. Kiara Lewis has checked in now. She's a good one, a freshman. In her first year, Syracuse with a shot from the left side. It's no good by Stratmana. They got the rebound, kick it out top, and the shot goes in and out. Stratmana had a look at it, and from behind, the shot is blocked. Great job as Jolie Toddy went up with the shot. Oregon reaching in from behind to knock it away. Ducks into front court. Here is Sabrina Ionescu to the right side of the floor. Taylor Chavez, the freshman, is checked in. Down underneath. Chavez, she'll give it out here to Corzola. Back underneath, a nice move inside. The shot coming up short. They got it low to Adi Gilden. And it was off the rim at the other end. Syracuse gets a quick shot up. Kiara Lewis underneath and a blocking foul going to be called against the Ducks. Here's the first one on the way, and it's perfect. Free throw good by Kiara Lewis, her first point of the ball game. And the Ducks lead now at 13 to seven. Second free throw shot coming up for Lewis, the sophomore, she got it to go. And it is a 13 to eight lead for Oregon. Down to five now with 3.29 left to play in the first quarter. 
Cazorla will walk it up into right front court. Draws double team pressure in her pass. Blocked away. There's a steal. It is Monica here coming up with the ball to the right side. The shot good up high off the glass from way out there. That shot put up by Isis Young for three or for two. And it is a three-point Oregon lead now at 13 to 10. Nice job by Syracuse since the timeout coming back. Here's a popper put up by Sabrina Ionescu, and she is fouled. It's good, and Sabrina will go to the free throw line. Tough hand in her face, drew the foul, and got the bucket to fall. And Sabrina, her first basket of the game here for Oregon. Sabrina bounces that ball a couple of times, shot on the way, and it's good. Three-point play for Ionescu in the Oregon lead. Back up to five, uh, six now at 16 to 10. Monica Hia, wing to the right, slide it up top. Now they'll go low post down deep, and the ball knocked away by the Ducks, picked up by Syracuse. Up top, here is Tiana on the drive, drives it underneath, and Cazorla got a hand on it, but it goes out of bounds. It'll be off of Maite. She tried to get that call switched to no avail. 2.41 left to play here in the first quarter. Syracuse down by half a dozen inbounding from the left side of their goal. Monica Hia out here on the wing to the left in front of us. They'll swing the ball back up, drive in the lane. The shot put on the way. It's no good from outside, and Oregon coming away with a rebound. Here come the Ducks, push it right back up the floor. Cazorla, left side of the circle. Now to Sabrina. Ionescu, take it left side on the wing. Out front, pop it around, right side, and back up top. Now to Hebert. Hebert double teamed out at the baseline, kick the ball back out top. Nice job to Chavez. Taylor will give it to Sabrina. And Ionescu dribbles up to the top of the key, put it on the floor, jumper on the way. Good, and she is fouled. Chance for a four-point play. Well, let's see if they did give her three. Now she was inside, and it will be a two, and the Ducks' lead is eight now at 18 to 10. Ionescu, for the second straight time, Puts it up against a tough hand, got it to go, and has an opportunity here at the free throw line. Her shot is no good, kicked in and out. And the Oregon Ducks dropping back quickly on defense. As Coach Graves said, it's gonna be that transition that'll make the difference. Shot from out front, off the rim, no good by Drummond. Miranda, the pass up the floor by the Ducks, he's picked off. It was Drummond who got it back. Leave it over right side, and Tiana's shot no good. Rolled off the rim and a jump ball called. Hebert is there for the Oregon Ducks. 148 to go here in the first quarter. This one has been quick. Just the one time out here in the first quarter of action. Cazorla now going to come out of the Oregon lineup. They'll get Morgan Yeager, the 5'9 sophomore, in for the Ducks. Oregon. Defending, Syracuse ready to inbound. Here is Tiana coming to the left side. Drummond pops one up off the pass. No good. Ball knocked away by Ionescu. She saved it from going out of bounds as she dives into the folks sitting on the baseline. Got the ball back in. Saved it to Ruthie. Down to the right front court for the Oregon Ducks. Here is Chavez. Taylor looking inside. Boy, Hebert is just wearing orange all over her defensively. Shot no good. Hebert got the rebound in traffic. Leave it back to Sabrina Ionescu. Nice drive through the lane. Put it up short. No good. Hebert got the rebound. Missed the shot. Tipped away. Syracuse coming away with the basketball in the orange. Quickly back up into front court. Had some numbers. Ducks back quickly from way outside. Shot on the way. It's no good from out front by Engsler. The freshman. Here is Chavez underneath, wide open under there for the Ducks. Oregon doing a great job spotting Gilden underneath. Audie dropped it in with the left hand off the glass, and Oregon's lead is now out to 10 at 20 to 10. We're down to 45 seconds left to go in the first quarter. Monica Hia out front. Underhand pass underneath, no traveling. Ducks wanted the travel call, and on the rebound, it's tipped out of bounds. It's off Syracuse, went off the hands of Emily Engsler, and it'll be Oregon's ball with 37.6 seconds on the clock. Syracuse drops the defense now back into the front court. Here's Sabrina. She'll walk it up. Lob it in front of us here to Taylor Chavez. 
Taylor, pop it back across to Sabrina. Sabrina, kick it to the right side on the wing. Chavez back out top. Here's the pass underneath. Hebert, little turnaround jumper. Not sure if somebody blocked it. She was falling backwards as she put it up. No good, 13 on the clock. And here is Syracuse in front court. Chance to cut into a 10-point lead here. Clock down to six. It is Monica Hia. Give it out here, left side in front of us. Cooper, Gabriel shot short off the rim and we come to the end of the first quarter. At the end of one, it's Oregon 20, Syracuse 10. We're coming back with second quarter action. This is the Oregon IMG Sports Network. Okay, thank you. Coming on the court is the newest recruit for the Ducks to show off their free throw shooting skills. Instructed by the Beaverton High School Wildcats, the newest member of the team has recorded 96% free throw shooting percentage during their career. Let's see those skills. I got a live read, yeah. Five of the Syracuse Orange with two points apiece in this ball game. They do spread it around. And Coach Hillsman, he'll get a lot of people in off that bench. Here we go to the second quarter. The Ducks with that 10-point lead. Sabrina Ionescu out top. Ionescu, left side. Works the ball over to Morgan Yeager. Yeager working around the guard of Drummond. Here's the kick pass over on the right side in the corner. Give it back up. Chavez wide open. Look at three. It is off the back of the rim. She had a good look at it. Couldn't get it to fall. And Gabriel Cooper had the rebound. Coop pushes it up to Tiana. Syracuse working the ball down deep. Hebert takes a big flop on the floor. And she's going to be called for. Oh, they're going to call the offensive foul, I believe. And that is the way the call goes. It'll be Oregon's ball. They worked that ball in deep. Once again, it was Jaldi Tabdi who kind of threw that elbow out a little bit, pushed her as she made her move to the basket and is called for the foul. Ducks ball, pressure put on by Syracuse here in backcourt. And a long lob pass almost picked off by the Cues. Oregon keeps it alive. Cazorla flies it over to Chavez on the right side along the sideline. She bounces it down to the baseline to Ruthie. Nice little move inside, and Ruthie is going to be called for the travel. That was good defense in there by Amaya Finkley as she was able to plant herself right in Ruthie's path, and Ruthie had no way to stop. She tried to shuffle and move around her and is called for the walk. It'll be Syracuse coming back up the floor, right to left. Down by 10 here to the Oregon Ducks in the second quarter. Monica Hia out front, bounces inside, then comes back outside the arc, whistles it over to the left side. In front of us here now on the left side of the floor. Nice little dig around move by Anxler. She got it to fall. Emily Anxler gets her first basket of the game. The 6-1 freshman showing some good movement there as she took it down the lane and the ball knocked away from Cazorla. It is picked up by Cooper. Gabriel on the drive, put it off the glass and in. And Syracuse with four points in a row is back within six of the Ducks, 20 to 14. Oregon now throws the ball up. It's picked off by Monica Hia to the hoop. Off the glass, too long. She couldn't get it to go. Oregon really seeing that Syracuse defense now getting tuned up here in the second quarter. Timeout, Ducks with 8-10 left to play in the first half. Our score, the Oregon Ducks 20 and the Syracuse Oregon. Back in Utah, that's where Terry Johns, Jerry and all the gang are. Jorgie's back there, the whole gang. We'll get to them after this game. We'll wrap things up fairly quickly, get to football. But right now, this women's basketball game is a good one. Oregon inbounds, go to Bowley, a lean-in shot, good from the right side. She was just inside the three-point line. Aaron with eight points here in the first half of this one for Oregon. Monica Hia backs the dribble out to the right side on the wing. Coming around in the circle, her pass is blocked away by Bowley. Picked up there by the Ducks. Oregon quickly into front court. Morgan Yeager, left side of the floor. Morgan, 
Looked at the shot, bounce it underneath, puts it up, Moley, and it's off the rim. No good. Chased and tracked down by Syracuse. They'll come back the other way quickly, push it up into front court to Kiara Lewis. Shot is put up. No good. There's a rebound, and it's Engsler. Engsler gives it out here, an open look at three. This one is off the rim, and a whistle blows. It was put up by Miranda Drummond. She was about two steps off the top of the key. On the rebound, the Ducks are going to be called for the foul. It'll be Syracuse with the basketball. Here is the inbounds play for Syracuse. And the shot blocked away. How about Ruthie Hebert? She does a great job getting out there quickly for Oregon. Hebert to Aaron Boley down in the corner on the left side. Boley kick it up here to UNESCO. Here's Boley driving up the baseline, stops, looks to kick out the pass, finds Sabrina way out front. Back around on the right side comes UNESCO. And we have traveling going to be called against the Ducks. They worked it down in the uh, right side there to Jaeger, and Morgan took off, tried to get to the baseline, and didn't get the ball down. Turnover by Oregon. They'll set the defense now. Monica Hia coming up the floor. She runs the show for Syracuse. One of the best basketball players in the country. There are a lot of those. We've got them all here on the same floor. And the Ducks right now with the lead at 22-14. Underneath on a drive down the lane. The shot is put up and good. Kiara Lewis, she's a good one. Four points for Lewis here in the first half for Syracuse. Oregon. To Morgan. Morgan right up the baseline, cut off by a sea of orange, and she spots Ruthie Hebert coming down the lane. Ruthie lays it up and in for Oregon. A shot from outside coming up the floor for Syracuse. It is no good from the right side. Hebert gets up there for the rebound. Now to Ionescu, coming down the lane, bounces it underneath. The ball is off of the hands of Gildan. Audi couldn't hang on to it, but Syracuse throws it away at the other end. And a long lob pass down there to Drummond. And Oregon will get the ball back as everybody takes a deep breath here with 5.46 left to go in this second quarter. The Ducks on top 24-16. And a chance to extend this lead into double digits again. Yonescu will drive the ball up for the Ducks. Brings it over the midcourt line with 541 left to play in the second quarter. Here's Sabrina out at the big O at midcourt. She comes around to the left side of the circle. Fly it back on the right side to Sabali. Satu, left side. It's Yonescu for three. Off the rim, no good. Caught the back of the rim. It rolled around and came out to Syracuse. They've got a little two-on-one. Stop, shot on the way. It's in and off the rim by Cooper. Gabrielle had a look, couldn't get it to fall. Here's Sabrina Yonescu. She looks to the right side. Wide open, Aaron Bully for three. Off the rim. Little bit strong, big rebound underneath there by Sabali. Give the ball to Bully. Coming down the lane, shot is blocked. It's picked up by Hebert. Can't get it to go and a whistle and a foul. That foul is gonna go against Gabrielle Cooper. Cooper picks up her first of the ball game and the Ducks will be at the free throw line. Ruthie Hebert taking a trip to the charity stripe here with five minutes and one second left to go in this first half. Free throw good. <laughs> Ruthie Hebert for the Ducks makes the first free throw, second on the way, and it's good. She got them both. The Oregon lead again at 10 at 26-16. Under five minutes left to play here in the first half of this one from Matt Knight Arena. Sissoko checked in for Syracuse. She got the ball to the left. The pass underneath is poked away out of bounds by the Ducks. Oregon doing a nice job right now defensively against this very quick Syracuse team. Ball is inbounded. Syracuse taking it down in deep, and the ball got loose. The Ducks pick it up. Satu Sabali coming down the right side. Flip it back over to the left to Sabrina. Underneath, Hebert, look out. She comes uncontested down the lane for two. 
Ruthie Hebert, what a look by Ionescu. Got her the ball. Syracuse with a quick shot at the other end. It's no good. Here come the Ducks, three on two. Underneath the bowl, she almost lost it, but hangs on the baseline. Underneath the shot, boom, by Satu. Check it, Gilded. Audie Gilded, not Satu, and Gilded did a nice job. Muscled it up, got it to fall, and drew the foul. She will go to the free throw line. Audie Gilded. Her free throw is good. Seven for Audie here in the first half of this one, and the Ducks now are up 31 to 16 over Syracuse. Kiara Lewis at the free throw line to the left side. She finds Sioku. No good. She put up a long shot about 20 feet away. It went over the rim. Duck shoot it down in the corner to Satu Sabali. Sabali back up top, left side. Ionescu over to Boley, open three. It's off the rim. She had a look at it, couldn't get it to drop. Syracuse coming away with the rebound. And out of backcourt, here comes the orange with Lewis in control. Kiera underneath, throws one up at the board, won't get it to go, and we have a whistle and a foul. Fighting for the rebound for Syracuse was Sissoko. She's going to be called for the hack on the arm. Or is it on Lewis? Let's check it here. That personal foul will be on Lewis. It'll be her second. And Oregon gets the ball with three and a half left to go here in this second quarter. Yadescu on the right side. Plays catch with Sibali and then dribbles around to the left side up off the circle. Sibali, high post, nice little pass underneath, the shot on the way, and it's no good. The Ducks worked it to Gilded about 15 feet away, put up a jumper and couldn't get it to go. Quickly, Syracuse wide open, look at three, it's way up off the rim. Hit the back iron, did Kiara Lewis in the orange, get the long carom for the rebound, and Cooper, good from just in front of us here on the left side. Gabrielle Cooper hits the long shot. Two of the nation's best, two top 20 teams duking it out here at Matt Knight Arena. Oregon in front court, Erin Bowley. She had a look and nailed it from 16 feet out. Just off the free throw line outside the arc there. And the Oregon lead now at 33 to 19. In front court, Monica Hia. Monica Hia out to Cooper. She puts it up a little bit strong. It's over off the glass and Bowley there to pick it up for Oregon. Bully to Ionescu, Sabrina into front court. Sabrina cuts to the left. Nice little dish underneath inside. The shot no good, and we had a duck down, but Sabali up off the deck. Quickly, the orange had a little 5-4 with the numbers. Flip it in the corner. Shot good from outside. That was a nice look by Isis Young. She gets her second basket here in the first half. It's an 11-point Oregon lead, 33-22. Yonescu, Satu Sabali, down on the corner. Now they come all the way out to Bowley for an open three, and it's just short. It caught the iron and came off, pushed out of bounds, went off the Ducks. It'll be Syracuse ball. Quentin Hillsman will make another change. He does move the orange in and out off that bench. He said, we used to have a rotation of seven people maybe. Now it's 10 or 11. And this is a coach that doesn't need a chair. That's for sure. He is up orchestrating. His orange are trailing by 11 to the Oregon Ducks. Here's Syracuse in front court. Young in front of us right now. Young stop and go dribble. Taking it down left side of the lane. Shot blocked out of there by Hebert, I believe. We've got a hand on it and knocked it away out of bounds. And Syracuse will inbound from down on the baseline. Clock at a minute 25 left here in the second quarter. Oregon 33, Syracuse 22. Here's the inbounds play coming to Young. Young kick it out high and the long shot on the way. It's off the back of the rim. No good in the Ducks with Hebert on the rebound and it was tipped away by Syracuse out of bounds. Good luck by Sisoku out there, but she was strong with it. And Ruthie Hebert showing why she is the 
number one power forward in the country. She plays strong down inside. Got a hand on that ball. Here's a little hook shot put up, and this one is going to drop for Syracuse. That was Finkley. She has four points here in the first half. The Oregon lead. Back to nine. Here's Janescu. Flips it to the right side. They'll go underneath. Cutting down the baseline. Bowley shot up off the bottom of the backboard. The Ducks back on defense as Syracuse comes away. Monica Hia underneath, scores, and we have a whistle and a foul. Great drive by Monica Hia. Tiana, a 5'6 junior. She is so quick. That first step to the basket. And the Ducks sliding across, trying for the block and get the foul. First foul on Chavez for Oregon. The free throw shot is good. And the Oregon lead now, down to six. It was at 12 moments ago. Here is Ionescu between the rings up top. Here she comes around to the left side, a little bit of a pick from Bowley. Out of Hebert, back to Bowley for three. This one, dipsy do hit the rim, went to the back and came out. And Syracuse looking to close the gap here before halftime. 26 seconds on the clock. Coming down the right side of the lane, and the ball knocked away by Oregon. Syracuse picks it up out in front of us here with 15 seconds on the clock. They'll take the last shot of the half. Monica Hia out here dribbling the ball in front of us. She moves in now with six on the clock. Monica Hia around Hebert. Her pass knocked away. Beautiful job by the Ducks. And then we have a whistle. Oregon doing a great job reaching in there. That was out of Gilded who got a hand on it, knocked it away, and the foul was called, so the Ducks are going to be at the free throw line. Gilded knocked it away to Taylor Chavez, the freshman. So he grabbed a hold of her with 1.3 seconds to go in the first free throw. Curls around the rim and off. Ducks got a big steal there as Syracuse with an opportunity to get within four at Oregon at the free throw line here. Second free throw coming up. This one is good. One of two Chavez. And there's the horn. We come to halftime here at Matthew Knight Arena. At the end of the four, Sabrina Ionescu. Those are the scoring leaders for Oregon. Syracuse led in scoring by a couple of players in the first half. They would be Tiana Monacahia with five and Gabrielle Cooper with five. It'll be Syracuse with the ball as we start the second half. The Oregon Ducks on top here, 34 to 27. Monacahia down underneath, got it wide open underneath at the window and the shot is put up and in by Finkley. And Amea had the easy layup, a nice pass from out top by Monacahia. Ducks into front court, right in front of us here with the basketball. Satu Savali, she'll give it up to Corzola. Corzola dances around outside the rim, passes underneath. Here's a nice little move inside by Ionescu. No good. And the rebound to Hebert, fall away jumper short. It is off the glass, off the rim and out. And here comes Syracuse now, looking to cut into the lead. They're down by five, and been down by as many as 15 in this one. Underneath, a little hook shot is good. They get it to Finkley underneath, and quickly Amaya gets the first couple of buckets of the second half. The Oregon lead is three. Here's some pressure at midcourt, put on by Syracuse. Ionescu sweeps the ball across, out toward midcourt to Ruthie Hebert. She'll drop underneath, leave it off to Kazula. Satu Sabali, open look at three. This one around the ribbon off, and Ionescu with a nice rebound. Climbing up high to pull it down. Ionescu, a little 15-footer, splat, it's good. Oregon lead back to five now. Underneath Syracuse, pass knocked away. Boy, a great job by Satu Sabali down there on the baseline. That long arm, she reached out and poked it away out of bounds. Syracuse. Inbounding, nice pressure by the Ducks on the inbounds play. Syracuse gets it into Gabrielle Cooper out on the wing. Cooper, leave it out to Tiana. Shot too short. It settled in there along the rim and came out to Ruthie Hebert. To Ionescu. 
Corzola. Ionescu looked at the shot coming outside to Boley. Short with the three point effort. No good. Tied up is Heber. Stratman are there to reach in on Ruthie and grab hold of the ball. The jump ball will give it to the Ducks here as we get things rolling in the third quarter. Oregon 36, Syracuse 31. Corner. It is Ionescu for three, and it's good from way outside. Boy, they had that one set up. Sabrina came away from the pack all alone on the left side of the floor and drilled it. Pushes the Ducks lead back out to eight. Come to Ionescu, driving it inside. Pops a jumper up high off the glass. No good. Bounced around Ionescu, chases it down out front to Corzola. That is Sabali. Sabali gets it back from Corzola. Outside the arc, foul line extended to the right. Has the ball right back from inside. That defense really pressuring one-on-one -on -one inside. Nice lean in by Ruthie Hebert coming down the left side. Drew the foul, and Ruthie will go to the free throw line. That foul will be on Miranda Drummond. So Drummond with her first, and Hebert going to the line. Here for the Ducks. Yeah, Ruthie's first shot kicks in and off. No good. Hebert's done a nice job inside. Nine rebounds in the uh, first half of this ball game, plus a couple of minutes. Second free throw good for Ruthie. She makes one of two. Monica Hia in front court. Here for the Orange. Switches left to right. Give the ball up. Nice pass underneath, wide open underneath. This one put up and missed inside. They got it underneath. A beautiful pass to Finkley, and it rolled off the rim. Set there for a moment. Ducks coming down with the ball. Once again, doing a nice job on the defensive board. Underneath to Hebert, coming in front of us here. Cazorla for three. This one off to the left, no good. Tipped away, and it was Syracuse ball and then tipped away by the Ducks, I believe. Boley going after it. Boley and Hebert back there and it went out of bounds. It'll be Syracuse ball with six and a half left in the third quarter. The Oregon lead is nine at 40 to 31. Biggest lead of the game, 15 for Oregon in the first half. Monica Hia on the left side for Cooper. Back underneath they go. Down inside deep. Little hook shot is put up and good. Tobdi got that ball down in low. Got it to fall. It's a 40 to 33 Oregon lead. Out front is Boley. Stops, pops. The shot no good. Had about a 12 footer straight out front. Off the iron to Syracuse. Here's the drive inside. Tiana kicking it in the corner and losing the ball. It'll be out of bounds. She flipped that pass hard as she could to Miranda Drummond, who was open over there. Off her hands out of bounds, and the Ducks will get it down near the bench of Syracuse. Just under six minutes left to go in this third quarter here at Matt Knight Arena. Corzola down to the free throw circle. Boley kick it out to Ionescu. The defense shifts as the Ducks move that ball around the arc. Here's to Sabrina, just off the free throw line. Left side, Corzola for three, and it's good. Marte Corzola got a look at it from the left side, and it was Ionescu with the great pass to open her up, and Maite drilled it. Oregon's lead back to double digits now at 10, 43-33. 5-10 left to play here in quarter number three. Syracuse on the right side. There's a nice drive inside, a quick move underneath. Boy, Kiara Lewis, what a talent. Red shirt sophomore, she got it to fall, drew the foul, she'll go to the free throw line. Kiara with six points on the afternoon here for the Orange. Her free throw shot is good. Hit the rim, kicked around, and fell through four. And Syracuse back within seven. Here's Sabrina Ionescu in front court. She takes it down the right side of the lane, kick it over on the right to Sabali. 
And back to Sabrina. Leave it out here to Cazorla. Now Sabrina, Cazorla, open look at three. This one, dipsy doo off the rim and out. Chased down over in the corner, and it'll be out of bounds to Syracuse. Oregon flying that ball around the floor. And we have a timeout going to in front court. Tiana flips it over on the right side to Sisaku. And the Ducks cover on defense. Oregon pressuring a little bit on defense, extending it outside the circle. Here's the drive inside, tipped away. Boley coming up with the ball. Nice job by Aaron Boley there on the pickup. Ionescu over to Cazorla, open three. It's off the rim. And Syracuse coming away with the ball on the other side is Stroudman. Back at the other end, and a late pass underneath and a little hook shot. This one is going to stay. Jaldi Tabdi got that ball on a pass across the baseline, and then the Ducks turn it over. Traveling is going to be the call in backcourt for Oregon. Adi Gilden trying to release the ball, and before it left her hands, shuffled the feet. It'll be Syracuse ball. And Syracuse for a third time doing a nice job on the comeback trail. They take it down in low. Here's a little turnaround shot, and it's good. Stratman are doing a nice job inside, in control. She got it to fall, and we have a three-point Oregon lead now at 43 to 40. Oregon, Ionescu, right side, free throw circle. Looked at the shot, put it on the floor. Sabrina will give it back to Corzola. Cazorla looking for Unesco, finds her, the shot up and off the rim. Sabrina had a look at it from out in three-point area, and it'll be out of bounds to Syracuse. So the Ducks are going to get Ruthie Hebert up off the bench. She'll check back in. And getting some minutes of rest, and she will come in here for Oregon. Syracuse, Monica Hia, out top, flops it underneath. There's a little turnaround shot. This one's off the rim, no good, and the Ducks got the rebound. Nice job by Ruthie Hebert working there with Ionescu. Here's Sabrina to the right side of Bowling. Aaron trapped out there by Monica Hia. She'll give it off to Maite Cazorla. Cazorla underneath, and we have a traveling call again on Adi Gilden, and boy, that was a tough one, but she had the call go against her. Ducks will make a shift in the lineup here and bring Taylor Chavez in, the 5'10 freshman. Oregon leads it 43 to 40. Syracuse down into front court in the corner. Slip it way out high to Monica Hia. She'll come around to the left side on the baseline drive and a nice move, a reverse layup, no good, and a whistle. It's going to be Oregon ball. She may have stepped on the baseline. Got blocked out there by a couple of players down there, but a turnover, and it will be Oregon with the basketball. Here's Janescu. She drives, got a nice little block inside, and the shot no good, but she drew the foul. Ruthie Heber really set her up, the defense around Ruthie, and Ionescu took the opportunity to drive to the basket. Now she'll go to the free throw line. That foul will be on Tabdi, and Ionescu at the line. Sabrina's free throw shot is no good. Hit the iron, kicked around, and came out. Sabrina one for three at the line. This one is good. And the Oregon lead, 44 to 40. Syracuse battling hard, down by 15, down by 10, down by a dozen. And once again, they battle back. They're within four of the Oregon Ducks. Syracuse, little stop and go dribble. Underneath, more great defense down in low and a turnaround shot up off the rim and it is good by Inksler. Boy, she had a nice little spin move off the baseline and got it to glance off the glass and in. And it's a two-point Oregon lead at 44-42. Here's Aaron Boley from outside, short with the three-pointer. And it is Syracuse on the fly. Mother Cahia, she stops, flips it out here to the right side, and the move down the lane to the baseline. It's open, and the shot is missed by Strutmana. Ducks coming away with the ball. It's Ionescu in front court. Here's Sabrina. Right in front of us at midcourt. 
to Cazorla. Back underneath, and Ruthie Hebert is fouled. She was in traffic down low. See who they're going to call it on. Emily Engsler at 6-1, a formidable presence down there. But Ruthie Hebert with some great position drew the foul, and Ruthie will go to the free throw line. That'll be the third on Engsler. Free throw shot is no good. Oregon struggling a bit at the free throw line. Oregon has made 7 of 12 at the line in this game. And Ruthie Hebert a chance to extend this to a three-point lead for Oregon. Ruthie's free throw shot, good. Made one of two. Ducks 45, Orange 42. And here comes Syracuse back down the floor. Long pass, tipped away. Bowley got it to Ionescu. Over the midcourt line comes Sabrina. She's cut off by the Orange. Darren Bowley, open look at three. Hit the front of the rim, couldn't get it to fall. And it's Syracuse with the rebound. Back the other way, no look pass to the right side. Cooper's shot, no good. Oregon got the rebound. Taylor Chavez push it ahead to Ionescu. To the left side, open is Cazorla. Good! <laughs> A big three by Maite, and what a beautiful pass. Hit her on the left side in the sweet spot. Maite Cazorla lifts the Ducks to a 48-42 lead. Here's Syracuse now, back down the floor to the right side. Another three ball, this one is off the rim, no good. Stratman had got the ball up there, couldn't get it to fall, and we get a whistle on the rebound. And if you couldn't tell by the crowd, that one will go against Oregon. Out of bounds to Syracuse here with 30.7 seconds left in the third quarter. Here comes the inbounds play, Syracuse. Monica Hia. Backs it out. Looks as though the Orange will go for the final shot of the third quarter. Oregon leads it 48-42. Clock at 15 seconds. Monica Hia, one of the nation's best point guards. She'll make the move now with seven seconds on the clock. Monica Hia driving the ball inside. Lays it up off the glass and in. And the Ducks set to inbound, and there's the horn. We come to the end of the third and a travel. It came off the pass by, I believe, Sisoku. Kariatu Sisoku, a six foot two freshman. It was either her or Monica Hia on the catch, and I believe that's the way they're going to rule that. Here are the Ducks in front court. Ionescu for three. Good from the left side. Ionescu, they left her open. That's a cardinal sin at the other end. Ball inside for Syracuse, and they got it to Monica Hia. She got a little layup off the glass and down. And we have a quick timeout with 9.29 to go. It's the Ducks, 51. Syracuse with 46. Remind you to catch the tip-off Tuesday. Coaches Radio Ruthie Hebert here with 9.28 left in the game. Ducks are going to see some Pressing defense as Cazorla comes into front court, races by the defense. Ionescu wide open three off the back of the rim. It's no good. The loose ball tracked down by Syracuse. They call a jump ball. And a great job by Oregon. That ball was headed right for Monica Hia. And Sabrina Ionescu diving in after it. That ball is going to be tied up. It'll be the Ducks ball here on the possession arrow. Here's the inbounds pass to Cazorla. Out front, about four steps off the top of the key. Now swinging around right side for Chavez as Oregon looks for Hebert. Finder out on the right side of the baseline. Here's Cazorla down the lane, caught the window, the rim, and it comes off. But the Ducks have the ball. It's tipped away by Syracuse out of bounds. Good hustle by Oregon off the miss, and the Ducks keep possession of the ball. Change now for Syracuse. The Orange will get Amaya Finkley back in the lineup. 
Coach Hillsman, he likes to move him in and out. Here's Taylor for three from way out on the right side. Ducks not able to get it to drop, and Syracuse coming back down the floor, left to right. And to the left side, the open look at three is no good. A quick shot put up there by Finkley. Ducks coming away with the rebound. Cazorla in front court. Cazorla got it back. Steps inside, the dishes back to Sabrina on the wing to the left. Saw to Sabali. Brow the right side, outside the ring to Taylor. Chavez. Here's Sabrina, give it back. Sabali on the drive into the lane, put it up off the back of the rim. Circled around and the rebound comes off to Drummond. Ahead for Syracuse, open underneath and a whistle and a foul as Hebert coming across, trying to defend against Finkley who had an open lane. And Finkley will go to the free throw line. That'll be the first foul on Ruthie here in the ball game. Free throw shot by Amaya Frank, uh, Finkley is good. The sophomore drilled it. And the Oregon lead now 51 to 47. Finkley, one of those very talented underclassmen that Hillsman has brought into Syracuse. Second one, hit the rim hard. Sabrina is there for the rebound. She attacked the ball. Ionescu with another rebound. Flip it ahead into front court. Here's Ionescu to Cazorla. Works the ball out front. On the right side now, the Ducks with Sabrina. Pops a jumper, rolls it up on the rim. It's off, no good. Hebert with a rebound, foul. Boy, good hustle by Ruthie Hebert. That ball danced on the rim. Ruthie had herself well positioned, got a hold of the ball, and then took a hack, and she'll go to the free throw line. Two coming up here for Ruthie. First one is all the way, and it's good. Hebert with nine points. And one more coming up here for Ruthie Hebert. It's on the way, and it's in and out. No good. Syracuse got the rebound. That was a good job on positioning down underneath by Syracuse. The Oregon lead at 52-47. Syracuse out in the corner, left side, three ball, put up, long range shot, no good from the corner. Syracuse got a rare second chance, put it up and missed it, a third chance, and this one goes. Finkley battling inside the 6-4, Amaya Finkley for two, and the Oregon lead is three. Here's Aaron Boley. She's trapped, little double team, ball pushed away, and a whistle and a foul, and I believe it's on Monica Hia. It will be a push on Tiana Monacahia. So that's the first foul on Monacahia. Second team foul here on Syracuse in this half. The Ducks inbound. Outside, Sabali, nice bounce pass underneath to Hebert. She muscled it up off the glass again. Ruthie Hebert with 11. Big basket for Oregon by Ruthie Ebert. She waited to feel the defense go up, waited for them to come down, and then hammered that ball up and in. And the Oregon Ducks now lead this one 54-49. Here's Monica Hia from outside. It's off the rim. And the rebound controlled by Syracuse underneath. They got one shot up and missed. Second one stays and a chance for a three-point play right now for Syracuse. Boy, Emily Engster, she just plays really hard inside. Engsler, rather. She's six foot one, the freshman. Missed on the rebound and then stayed with it. Got the second one to fall. And she got the three point play. That foul was on Ruthie Hebert. Her second. The Oregon lead is two at 54 52. Here's Sabrina Ionescu. Yonescu out on the right side. An open look for Sabali off the rim. No good. Syracuse got the rebound. Here comes Engsler down the floor. Leave it left side over to Monica Hia. And we have a whistle as Monica Hia got rid of the ball. And we're going to have a pushing foul. It's, let's check and see who that one was on. Looks like they're going to call that one on Morgan Yeager. And Morgan picks up her first foul of the game. 
Here comes the inbounds play. Syracuse can tie or take the lead. They trail by two, have not led in this game. Underneath, push it down deep to Engsler. Got it to drop with 6.14 left in the game. We're all tied at 54. Syracuse down by as many as 15. They've come back to tie it here in the fourth quarter. Here is Sabrina Ionescu for three. Good. She lights the lamp from out on the left side, and the Ducks are on top. In the corner, here's a jump shot on the way. It's short. Put up from out there on the right side by Finkley, and the Ducks come away with the ball. Quickly into front court comes Ionescu. Under five minutes left to play in the game. The Ducks tied with Syracuse. Here is Sabrina. She puts one up. Looked like she got hit on the arm, but there's no foul called. And here comes Syracuse the other way. Lewis to the rack, put it up, missed it off the rim, and Hebert is there to collar the rebound for Oregon. All tied at 57. Here's Kazorla. Round right side of the free throw circle to Sabali, and then a whistle away from the basket. Gonna have an elbow thrown. That'll be Miranda Drummond picking up the foul. Miranda gets her second foul. Four and a half left to go in this one. All tied at 57 here at Matt Knight Arena. And the Ducks will inbound. Maite Cazorla takes the ball on the baseline from the official. Kick it into Ruthie, and it's almost stolen away. We get a whistle here, and a foul's going to be called on Syracuse. Going to be a hack on the arm. So Monica Hia picks up her second foul, and Kozorla will just move across the baseline now, down to the right side of the basket, and will inbound from there. Maite takes the ball. Four and a half left to play in this one. To Sabrina, out top of the circle. Round left side. Now to Kozorla, driving the lane, put up a hook shot. Fouled as she goes up strong. She put up a little hook shot over Emily Inksler, and... They tee her up. A technical foul is going to be called for the reaction to that foul. It was a good call. Engsler is not happy with it. This game tied at 57, and there will be a couple of technical free throws coming up here for the Ducks. Sabrina Ionescu will shoot those for Oregon. Normally, a spot-on free throw shooter, Sabrina, two for four at the line in this one. She has 17 points for the Ducks. Now Kelly Graves will bring the rest of the Ducks over to the sideline to chat as Sabrina gets ready to shoot the technical free throws. Still some discussion. Engsler up here and the officials getting an earful from Quentin Hillsman down the way to the right. Not happy with the foul call and then with the technical. So now Hillsman says, let's uh, get Engsler away from there and uh, unhappy as I might be, I'll head down to the bench as well. At the free throw line is Sabrina Ionescu here for the Ducks. What a big second half Sabrina has had. She really started coming on toward the end of that second quarter. Free throw good by Sabrina. And the Ducks again have not relinquished the lead. They've led from the outset. Right now it's 58-57 Oregon. Sabrina's second free throw, good. She got them both. And the Ducks lead is two at 59-57. Now Cazorla, who was fouled, will go to the free throw line. She'll shoot two and made a nice move into that shot before she drew the foul. Free throw good. And the Oregon lead out to three at 60 to 57. Second shot here for Maite. It's on the way and it's good. And the Ducks are on top 61 to 57. Here comes Syracuse, 420 on the clock here as we wind this one down in the fourth quarter. The Oregon crowd on their feet. Here's the drive inside, shot is up and good. A beautiful pass to Tabdi, Jaldi Tabdi off the pass from Marakahia. 
And the Ducks with that two-point lead into front court here for Oregon. Left side of the floor. Sabrina, Ionescu, jumper up. It rolls around the rim and out. No good and a whistle and a foul. It's going to be against Ruthie Hebert, who went after that one, tried to take it away. Ruthie with her third foul. And here's Syracuse now, bringing it up into the front, 47. Monica Hia bounces the ball, waiting for the defense to come out. Here she comes now, across to the top of the key. Stop and go dribble, leave it right side. Cooper, open look at three. It's good from outside by Gabrielle Cooper. And the Oregon lead is now gone as Syracuse takes a 62-61 lead. First lead of the game with 3.15 to play. Oregon from outside, the jumper, no good by Sabali. Syracuse brings it down. Monica Hia, as the Orange try to add to their first lead of the game, it's one at 62-61. Under three minutes left to play in this one. Here's Monica Hia. She drives around the circle to the right side, throws it up and scores. What you would expect from the 5'6 junior, Tiana Monica Hia. And Oregon trailing by three. Here's Cazola down to the left side of the circle. Go to Bowling. Aaron to Cazola. Down underneath the Hebert. Fallaway jumper. No good. Rebound Syracuse. Tough work inside by Tobdi. And Syracuse back the other way. 2.20 on the clock. The Orange lead it 64 61 here over the Ducks. Pass around to the right side. Syracuse taking care of the ball. Down into the corner, an open look at three. Caught the iron, it's good from down in the corner by Gabrielle Cooper. And it is a six point lead for Syracuse with under two minutes to go. 67-61, Syracuse on top. Cazorla down to Ionescu for three. Good from the corner. Timeout, Dominic and half shooting 68%. 68.4%. As a team, in this half, they're shooting an even 50%. Great job by the Ducks in getting it done when they needed to. 40 seconds left to play. Oregon on top, 70 to 67. Syracuse takes it down inside. Loose ball picked up by Syracuse. Outlet pass stolen away by Corzola. Rather, Cazorla, and Cazorla came away with the ball. It was knocked away. Ionescu also there. And we have a whistle and a foul going to be called here on Syracuse. Cazorla got the steal, and the foul is going to be on Monica Hia as she picks up her third foul of the ball game. What a great play by Cazorla, though, to come away with that ball in traffic down there. She picked up the steal, and that'll give the Ducks. Finkley's had a big game with 11 points, the same for Matakahia and also with 11 points, Cooper. The Ducks are led by Ionescu with 25, 13 on the afternoon by Bowling. Free throw good by Cazorla. She has 11 in the game, is three for three at the free throw line, and the Ducks' lead is four, 71-67. Second free throw good by Tay. Drilled them both. And the clock is running. Inside, half a minute left in this one. Here's Monica Hia in front court for Syracuse. She puts it on the floor, drives inside, put it up left hand, it's off the rim, no good. Rebound, shot up and good. Nice hustle inside by Jaldi Tabdi. And a timeout gonna be called here by Oregon with 18.3 seconds on the clock. The Ducks lead it 72 to 60 to Hia. She drives to the lane, put it up, left hand scores with 11 seconds on the clock. 73-71 Ducks. Now we'll see some very heavy pressure put on by Syracuse with 10.8 seconds on the clock. Monica Hia, 13 points on the afternoon to lead Syracuse. Not unstoppable, but she is a force. Drives well in traffic. Got to the hoop, a lot of pressure now gonna come up on this inbounds play. But while the Ducks wait to inbound it, Syracuse calling a quick timeout 
And the orange gathered down to our right around Coach Quentin Hillsman. Your Ducks go above and beyond every single game. Rocket Mortgage goes above and beyond to provide a seamless mortgage experience. Rocket Mortgage by Quicken Loans, proud mortgage provider of Oregon Athletics. Looking at the pit crew across the way, decked out in those nice yellow t-shirts. They have been at it all through this ball game. And again, nice to see such a huge crowd of Oregon fans as the Ducks looking to put this one away against Syracuse. A lot of pressure put on Oregon. Inbound to Cazorla. She is quickly fouled. They're following behind. Gabrielle Cooper picking up the foul. And free throws coming up here for Maite as she'll step to the line with 8.6 seconds on the clock. Maite's free throw, good. Oregon's lead. Second one, good. Maite got them both. And the Ducks are up by four. Six seconds on the clock. Underneath, there's a fallaway shot. Good. It drops in. Once again, Monica Hia, the Ducks inbound the ball. It's to Gillescu at the horn. And Oregon holds off Syracuse, winning 75 to 73. It was a tight one. Two top 20 teams going at it here in Eugene. And the Ducks win their 